but it's um, special. And it's never been done before in history, so blessed to have been healthy. You know, you got to play you know, night in, night out to have that kind of consistency and, and try to shoot the ball at a high level. Um, two years ago, I think I broke the record the first time. <coughs> Reaching 300 seemed crazy. Um, and still kind of surreal to <clears throat> have accomplished, accomplished that knowing you know, I love to shoot the ball and, and try to do it at a high level. You, you did it against, on the play against Ilya Sova when you crossed over. What do you think on a play like that when you get a big fan of going up against him? I was trying to get him somewhat off balance. He, he kind of played good D, he kept his body on me, and I just had a good rhythm with the dribble. And, it's kind of the same story we've had when it does become a problem. It's because we're going to have turnovers the way we play, and there's going to be some that we were trying to you know, make the right play or our intention was good. We just don't you know, execute it and convert whatever pass it is or whatever Joe move. But the 10 to 12 of them, which is a lot that are unforced and uncharacteristic, um, that's where you get into trouble. And besides that, I think we, tonight we played a pretty decent game. It's just you give them that many extra possessions. That talented NBA team that you know, they get paid just like we do. Of all the records. You're going to be in trouble if you don't uh, take care of the ball. Of all the records that you've uh, broken this year, what's, what's going to be the one that's going to stick out in your mind the most and mean the most to you? Um, it's, Kind of hard to answer that with 20 games left, I think, because you know, that, um, that win record is still in, in, in reach. So if we, if we accomplish that, which you know, we're going to play play for it and night in, night out, uh, that would be something, something very memorable. I know 